as if Skyrim didn't have enough outsiders. Now we've got mercenaries from Hammerfest. <sighs> yes. One of these days... One of these days I will prove to everyone that mercenaries from Hammerfell are... I don't know, more valuable than the Nords seem to think they are? Who knows? Who's this guy? Excuse me? Need something? Uh... Nope. Until next time. Mm-hmm. He's a shady fellow, isn't he? I. <laughs> Someone's had one too many. I sleep well, no matter how much drink I put in me. I wouldn't recommend drinking more. Uh, I'd recommend maybe. Uh, I don't know. Some lavender tea. It has to be. I I've got to get out of this town. I'm so what? tired. They're just dreams. Please tell her, Erandor. Listen to your friend, Fuki. They mm -hmm. are just dreams, my friend. <sighs> I assure you that it is quite normal. It's the same dream over and over again. You think that's normal? It's evil, I tell you. Erandor, she has a point. You keep telling us no harm will follow these dreams, but they must be an omen. Give him a chance to speak. He's trying to help us. Everyone, please. I'm doing what I can to end these nightmares. In the meantime, all I ask is you remain strong and put your trust in Lady Mara. I, I will. Um, Thank you. Hmm. Interesting. I just found an amulet of Mara. I wonder if it belongs to this guy. Talk to him in a minute. Frost took my husband years ago. He was a good man. I'm sorry to hear you that. You look like someone who can hold their liquor. How about a friendly contest to win a staff? I'm not much of a staff person. Sorry. My children Need a room? grew up and left Don't worry. Nightmares don't people. seem to happen for travel. <laughs> oh, well, I've got enough weird dreams of my own, but... Yes, I would like to rent a room, please, if that's alright. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thanks. Uh, and a refill of water? Of course. <sighs> and I'll see about provisions in the morning, I think. Mm -hmm. Yes? If you're looking for a challenge, you've come to the right place. I'm not looking for a challenge. I... A few drinks, a few laughs, and a contest. What could be better? Excuse me. What troubles you, my daughter? I heard you talking about... a curse. And bad dreams. Is there something wrong? The entire town is being plagued by horrible nightmares. They're in serious danger, but I'm afraid there's little I can do about it. Well, I mean... I mean, uh, I'm not sure there's anything that could be done about it. Dreams are just dreams, and I don't think you can change them. These dreams are manifestations created by the Daedric Lord, Vermina. She oh. has an awful hunger for our memories. In return, she leaves behind nightmares, not unlike a cough marks a serious illness. I must end her terrible influence over these people before the damage becomes permanent. Okay, do you have a plan? I need to return to the source of the problem, to Nightcaller Temple. Perhaps you'd be willing to assist me in that regard. Maybe. Although... 
Not right now. I've, I've had a bit of a day. Um, dreams are the least of my problems right now. But what do you mean, return? You've been there before. I've already said too much. If anyone overhears what we're saying, it could start a panic. Then why are you talking in front of these two I lovely ladies? I would simply ladies? ask that you trust me and help me end Dawnstar's nightmares. All right, I trust you. Although, uh, we probably could have picked a better time to talk about this, huh? Wonderful. My Lady Mara will be quite pleased. Nightcaller Temple is only a short walk from Dawnstar. Come, we must hurry. In... In the morning. Dawnstar has always held its own against the bandits and wild animals. Okay, now that they're gone, who is the Daedric Lord Vermina? That's a name I'm not familiar with. Vermina resides in a strange realm known as Quagmire, a nightmarish land where reality shifts upon itself in seemingly impossible ways. From her citadel at the center, she reaches forth to collect our memories, leaving nothing in return apart from visions of horror and despair. That... that explains a few things. What does she do with the memories? Who can say? Perhaps she collects them for display like works of art in a nonsensical art gallery. Whatever the case may be, her intentions are far from benevolent. Okay. Well, I don't think I've forgotten anything yet. I'll meet you at the temple in the morning, okay? Right now, I need to get some sleep if I can. I promise Welcome. to answer all of Let your questions. You Follow me. Think I got a clean mug? Need something? something? I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Oh. Huh? Speak. Uh, sorry. You Were you talking to me, or...? Let me know if there's anything else you need. I'm going to assume yes. And I'm going to sleep with my armor on because of her. Do you remember the time oh. when that wolf pack came? Ring into town. That'll do. How could I forget? That old alpha male almost took off my leg. Never did find out why they came sprawling into town like that. Animals in the pale don't need a reason to attack Dawnstar. It's just their nature. That's not how animals usually work. Uh, Thorin. Uh, I'm looking for some provisions. Let's sate that appetite, huh? Got a bit of interest in your boss, do you? Let's see what we can do here. That'll do. Just some stuff for the road. It'll be fine. No. Thank you. See ya. I'll see if I can take care of these nightmares people are having, okay? If you're looking for a challenge, you've come to the right place. I am not looking for a challenge. Jeez, what's wrong with me? The Wind Peak Inn features the finest bard in all of Dawnstar. Me. Hmm, now there's a challenge. Anyway. Yes? Uh, sorry, I'm looking for... There you are! Erender, right? Yes, my daughter. What is it I can help with? I'm following you. This way, my daughter. I don't know which way we're going, but... As if but... didn't have enough this outsiders. Way. Now we've got mercenaries from Hammerfell strutting about. Say that one more time. Okay, okay. <clears throat> Frost took my husband years ago. It's good to finally have a chance to help man. these people. Helplessly watching them suffer has been difficult. I imagine so. I'm like that too. I can't stand to see people suffering. Not if I can help it anyway. That better not be a the bandit. Tower on that hill is our destination. People the around here call it is the Tower of it the Dawn. Give me one I'm second, Erinor. With the tower's history, but it was I deserted quite a long time before Nightcaller Temple 
established yes. inside. Okay. I'm back. Sorry. When the temple was active, the priests would rarely be seen at Dawnstar. They preferred to live a solitary existence. Oh. The temple's okay. been abandoned for decades now. Ironic, isn't it? A ruin within a ruin. Huh. There's a small shrine to Mara I established inside the tower's entry hall. I was hoping to seek spiritual guidance from her. Perhaps my prayers were answered. Your reason for stumbling across Dawnstar is more than a mere coincidence. You know, I'm glad that I found you, Erender. Because I... Things have been weird lately. I actually found an amulet of Mara before I got to Dawnstar, and that's what made me talk to you. So maybe Mara did answer your prayers. Although... I'm not sure why she picked... Uh, if she picked me? I suppose it could have been coincidence that I'm the one who found it, huh? A man of few words, I see. I can appreciate that. Make sure I had my shield out. It wouldn't do to, like, get ambushed by wolves or something out here. I heard a lady in the inn talking about how the, the animals just kind of attack Dawnstar at their leisure. That wouldn't happen to have anything to do with Vermina, would it? can't make you see visions of someone else's life, can she? Yes, my daughter. What is it I can help with? Uh, never mind. This way, my daughter. Yeah, I'm following you. Well, actually, I'm following, a following the path right now. And running into all of the trees. I'm going to assume that Vermeen is the cause of this, because I can't think of anything else it could be. I mean... I've always been a little weird. A little weirder than... most, I should say. Apparently Kine wants me here, too. I just saw a spectral fox run by, I think. I'm not gonna go after it, though. You know, I'd rather not leave a priest out in the cold like this, you know? But... I just wanted to say things have been getting a little weird with me lately. Seeing things... Remembering things that... You know, I'm not even sure if they're memories, but they feel like memories. But it's not me. So I don't really know what's going on and I kind of hoped you might have some eldritch wisdom for me. I don't know if eldritch is the right word. I... I would be on your guard, Erinder. That goat was running from something and I don't know what. I do know what. I see spiders. Oh, that was... Mistakes were made. For what? Uh, 
killing spiders, or...? That was oddly touching. Where did that come from? Before we enter, I must warn you about the dangers that could be lurking within. Okay. Years ago, this temple was raided by an orc war party seeking revenge. They were being plagued by nightmares, just like the people of Dawnstar. That's... Were they successful? No. Knowing they could never defeat the orcs, the priests of Vermina released what they called the Miasma, putting everyone to sleep. Why is it dangerous if they're asleep? I'm concerned that when this place is unsealed, the Miasma will dissipate and they'll awaken. Both orcs and priests alike. Oh, great. Huh. <sighs> you know, I've never much liked orcs, and I don't really know why. What is the... That sounds really bad of me. I'm sorry. Uh, what does the Miasma do, exactly? The Miasma was created by the priests of Vermina for their rituals. It's a gas that places the affected in a deep sleep. Because the rituals would last for months or even years, the miasma was designed to slow down the aging process. Uh, okay. That's... interesting. Is the gas dangerous? Sadly, yes. The longer an individual is exposed to the miasma, the more the mind can become damaged. Those who've been under the effect of it for extended periods of time have been known to lose their minds entirely. Thus... In some cases, a few never awoke at all. Oh. Thus why it might be dangerous going in there if... if people wake up that have been breathing in the miasma for who knows how long. That makes sense. Once we get inside, all become clear. Clear as mud. Alright, let's do this. Oh boy. <laughs> 